Well, looks like I'm working inside today. Okay, so I decided I needed to change things up a little. Not what I was doing for videos, but how I was doing it. And I realize I don't just I don't have a dedicated space. Okay. Which when it comes to a lot of hobbies, that can be the problem is like you're you know, really want to do something, but you don't have that dedicated space for it. So The way Mr. Atwood and I have things set up is we each have our own extra room. Not like where we live, but, you know, and sleep, but, you know, we just have this extra room. Now, the rooms, though, have to double duty as bedrooms for the kids when they visit for the summer. So, my room was a disaster because it had the last of our storage unit dumped all over it. You know, finally getting it cleaned up. So, yes, kittens even invade this space. So what I decided to do is I'm going to kind of studio-fy things. Make it, you know, get to making it my space. Mr. Atwood made it their room, their space. You know, sewing all the good stuff, but... I just never really got around to it. So, that's the project. Almost there. Kids get here in a week. You know. It's got to do something. So, a lot of sorting, a lot of putting things together. I have crafting table, projects. Since I'm in where my computer is, I'll be able to do like YouTube live, not just Facebook live. Because until you reach a certain amount of subscribers, you, can, you can't you can do mobile YouTube live stuff, which is kind of a pain. Get my 3D printers back up and running. They'll have their own little dedicated toolbox. I'll need to set up my sewing machine. Got some more tools kind of hidden away back there at the moment. The pegboard is actually for going behind the 3D printers to hold their tools and spools and things like that. So the boys are really interested in 3D printing stuff, so we'll be able to actually use them and make some things. Closet. Closet is Closet space is a premium, though. It's got all the SCA-related camping stuff, so that pile is actually that tall because there's tent, uh, canopy, you know, cots, spare mattress, you know, project in the works. You know, so all things to do. Drill press is probably going to mount on this cart, so I can roll it around and adjust where I'm using it. I just need to figure out like a top that I can set on, because even though this is pretty sturdy, I don't know about the weight. And totes of gear and other things to sort. So we're almost there. Just. Just not quite. So, but you know, it's kind of the same thing if you're a kid starting out. You know, you got your room to work in. You got 
your dorm room or you know your room in your apartment you share with however many others you can't really spill all over so we're gonna kind of work on that this is a studio slash experimental space so, kind of a pretend loft with a desk you know things are built up underneath storage so kind of where things are at and go from there hope everybody's having a good day talk to you later